Josh, are you ready to swim? As ready as I'll ever be. Which means no. Never ready to swim. You can't put this in the vlog, my hair looks horrible. Hey guys, what's up? It's Danny. In today's vlog, I'm gonna be vlogging my whole entire weekend because I realized that I haven't made a weekend in my life vlog in a really long time and I wanna show you guys what I do on the weekends. I decided to be really productive this morning. I woke up with my triathlon club, Tricanes, and we're about to go for an open water swim. Yo, so look who I ran into, the one and only, Jacqueline Schwartz. Hi everybody. Jacqueline, what's up? Tell me, what are you doing? Cause you're not a UM student anymore. That is true. I graduated in May amongst COVID, and now I'm working part-time with this team, Full Circle Triathlon Coaching. Full Circle Triathlon. So I started Tri-Canes, and now I'm working with a new team. So I think Tri-Canes is better, though. You have to admit, Tri-Canes is a lot better. So guys, tri join Tri-Canes. Tri-Canes is the best thing that happened to me ever. I've definitely filmed in this area before. I think I made like a whole video about it that I'm gonna leave like up there, but this is Key Biscayne. Look at how cool that skyline looks. Like if you want like a really cool picture, like really aesthetic, really Instagram worthy, like this is where you go to take that picture. Here in Key Biscayne, sometimes you find really, really adorable dogs. I mean, just look at these cute dogs. You just can't resist them. But guys, legit, I have a really good swim streak going. This is my second week in a row of open water swimming. Evie, so how many weekends in a row have you gone swimming? Um, this is the first one, but at the beginning of the semester, I went for like five weeks straight, probably. Oh, okay, so are you, are you hyped for today's swim? I'm very hyped. I'm gonna touch the water to see <laughs> if it's cold, because if it's too cold, I'm gonna be really, really pissed. Let's see how cold or hot this water is. It's not that okay, cold. It's not that cold? It's not that cold. It's not that cold. No, it's perfect, yeah, it perfect weather first. No, it, it is pretty good, it is pretty good. Josh, are you ready to swim? As ready as I'll ever be, which means no. Never ready to swim. You can't put this in the vlog, my hair looks horrible. On a scale of one through 10, how do I look right now? Leave it down in the comment section below. This weekend, there's four things in my to-do list, but those four things are really important. I'm actually starting to use this thing more often. This weekend, I have to make two videos, and by making the videos, I mean like actually making them, like filming, editing, like putting them on YouTube, like doing everything with these videos. One of the videos is a regular upload. It's just gonna be a sit-down video because I really didn't vlog much like last week, but then the next video is a sponsorship, so like I actually have to get it done. And on top of all the YouTube stress, I have two projects that are due and these projects are just not like your regular projects that you can like chill back relax like no these projects are worth almost like 50 percent of my grade so yeah it's gonna be a pretty long crazy weekend well actually it's not gonna be a long weekend but you get the point it's gonna be like a lot of things due in a really short amount of time So after like 40 minutes of writing, we finally have the final product for video number one. If you guys are ever really curious on how I do my sit down videos, basically it's like me in my room like this. I have the script right there, but because of iCloud, it syncs into my phone. So I have like all the talking points. I have the ring light. It's just me, my camera, and I'm ready to go. The homecoming game and I should be at the stadium watching the game live but because of COVID that is not happening but instead of going to the stadium me and my boy Carlos Carlos tell them where we are right now we're at yard house having a great time getting some drinks some food and just enjoying the game bro tell them about the people that like were not patient what happened when we got here hey, the people came they set up their time at the end of the day they left and we got a table and we had a great time, you know? No, so me and Carlos, we come in. The lady literally says, you're gonna have to wait one hour. How much did we wait? Like 30 minutes at most, Maybe right? Maybe 30, 35 at most, yeah. So we were very patient, not impatient at all, waited 30 minutes, got a table, 
Got a bunch of drinks, had a good time. Bro, hopefully though, UM wins, because the, na the game is very narrow. Super tight, like, I mean, we'll, we'll pull it out, you know. UM, let's get it. By the time people watch this video, they're gonna know, like, the result, but what do you think? You think we got this? Oh, hell yeah, yeah, we definitely got this, for sure. Hopefully we got this game against Virginia. It's all about the you, it's all about the you, it's all about the you, you say it. Change of plans, I did do video one, I filmed it, I was able to edit it before I went out last night, but video two, which is the sponsorship video, that video will not be happening. And even though I'm kind of disappointed that I didn't get to do the second video, it's not a big deal because I got to go out last night and watch the game, and right now, as a senior, I'm kind of like putting my social life as a priority because I really don't know what's gonna happen after I graduate. For this sponsorship, I got sent this really big box by a company called FlexiSpot, and they want me to review one of their products. Last night, if I didn't go out to watch the game, this is what I would be doing, kind of like unpacking everything because this box has been lying around in my house for like almost a month now. All right, let's see how this thing works. It should have like a hook or something where like it just like rises up. Let's see. This is the desk riser that I need to review in another video. I think I'm gonna play around with this thing for a little bit. Like, look how cool it is when it rises. But yeah, play around with this thing for a little bit, map out a video for this, and then later, I actually have to go to campus because I need to get work done. Every Sunday afternoon, I have a routine where I come to campus so I could study, work, and get done. There's two main reasons on why I'd rather be on campus when it comes to like getting done as opposed to like staying home first one is when i'm home i have so many distractions i have my computer my tv my cuban parents yelling 24 7 it just doesn't work second reason is because during covid zoom days like i just have so much ptsd of like studying in my room just trying to focus so what i said to myself is like when this all ends i'm gonna come to campus and study as much as i can even if it's on the weekends because it's senior year and like i'm never gonna be able to do this again The good news is that I got all my work done, but the bad news is, is that it's 9 p.m. and I am on campus. I just came to realize this, but I literally end my week where I start my week because tomorrow's Monday and like literally in the morning, I'm gonna be here on campus and like it's tonight and I'm on campus, so I don't know. Just something weird to think. But guys, just like every night when I leave campus, I am tired, I am hungry, and I'm going straight home. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog. I got to see more of like what I do on the weekends. This weekend was like really busy, so I'm really lucky I got to go out to like watch the game and just like have some fun. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below to stay up to date on my weekly uploads. That is it for me, but always, always remember to stay hydrated.